What's going on? Today we're going to talk about the Google Ads magic formula. Uh, this is something that I talk with clients uh, very often. Um, Google Ads is this mysterious, complex, hard platform. Um, I'm going to break it down into really three, three columns, if you will, that you really have to pay attention to in order to succeed with your Google Ads campaign. What's going on? This is Ed here from ClicksGeek. We're a premier Google partner agency. Uh, we specialize in generating leads using Google Ads. Uh, we've got services that we offer, both direct to the business. We've got white label PPC services. We also offer training courses um, teaching people how to do Google Ads. So let's jump into the formula. The magic formula is this. It comes down to three, three columns, if you will. It's select the right keywords. It's write compelling ad copy. And send them to a page that's going to convert the traffic at a high enough rate. If you can nail all three of those, you will have a successful Google Ads campaign. Now, underneath each of those columns, there are some subcategories that we'd want to look at. For example, under selecting the right keywords, we want to go after... Now, let me back up real quick. Most businesses don't have an unlimited budget. You know, they've got a budget that they have, and you've got to do the best you can with what you've got. So, let's go with a junk removal service for uh, as an example. Uh, we want to go after keywords in that first column that are bottom of the funnel keywords, junk removal service, junk removal service near me, junk removal service Raleigh, things like that that denote um, interest in buying activities in that market now versus um, something more more high level like um, or, or more research based like for example, if you're using like broad match, you might get something like how to start a junk removal business or something like that. That's the kind of stuff that you want to avoid. Um, you really want to dial in really tight on your keywords, especially if you've got a limited budget. So get the right traffic going to your site. So exact match, phrase match is typically where you want to start. Clean traffic. Next step is write compelling ad copy. And underneath that, you're going to mix in stuff like using your extensions properly, call extensions, address, address extensions, all the site links, everything you can do to bolster the ad, make it bigger, make it more appealing, especially on mobile, and write ad copy, write direct response style ad copy that's going to elicit the click, okay? You want a high click-through rate. Next is send them to a page that's going to convert the traffic at the highest possible rate. Typically, when we do landing pages, we're shooting for anywhere between 20 and 40%. That's the range we're shooting for. Um, we know if we can dial in categories one, two, and three, we're going to have a successful campaign at the end of the day. That is the magic Google Ads formula. Under each of them, there are other categories that we could look into, but at a high level, that's really it. Get quality traffic, um, or I should say, be in a pool of quality traffic, earn that quality traffic, and then convert that quality traffic. And that's it. One, two, three. If I had three steps to explain Google Ads and how to be successful with it, that's it. Um, there are exceptions to this, but at a high level, that's it. Um, you're going to then layer in stuff like your bidding strategy, your negative keyword list, your device adjustments, your ad schedule, your ad budget, your geo-targeting. All these other things are, are kind of secondary to the core three, if you will. It's get quality traffic, earn the click with enticing ad copy that compels them to click, and then convert that traffic. Have a landing page or a site that's going to convert the traffic at a high enough rate so that it makes sense for you to continue running Google Ads for your business or for your client's business. That's it for today. Just a quick lesson on the magic formula. One, two, three. All right, that's it. If you need anything, links will be in the description. Have a great day. Bye.